Hey guys, happy Sunday. Okay, welcome to Cooking with Shalane. So today we will be cooking rice and peas, fish and kalu on the side. Let's go. Guys, I put the peas to pressure and it has finished. So now I'm adding my coconut milk and my seasoning to favor the plant. So let's go. I add in my coconut milk. It was frozen in the fridge. So I just take it out, add water to the pot and the peas is at the bottom underneath this. So I didn't video the first part because actually I wasn't going to video it, but um, I got a call from one of my supporters and she like, let me see what you're doing. So I actually, um, I sold the peas from overnight and then I add water to the peas, add some salt and add garlic and pressure it in the pressure cooker. After that, I pull the pressure cooker, I add um, the milk, uh, coconut milk and then now I'm going to add seasoning. So um, thyme, scallion and pepper. So I'm going to wash these and prepare them to go in the pot. So my seasoning is washed. Now I'm just going to beat the scallion. I kind of press it out like this. Kind of press it out for it to go in the pot. Coconut milk is actually floating on the top, so I'm just going to add these, the seasoning that I prepared a while ago. And just cover it to make it stop start boiling. It's time for the fish. I actually seasoned the fish like last week, so it's kind of well seasoned. This is that grunt. It's grunt. Okay, guys. So I I put on the frying pot, and then I'm going to add some oil to it. After it, I pre the pot, and then I add oil to it. So I forgot to put in some butter in the rice and peas, so we're going to put in some butter now. So adding three slices of butter in the rice and peas. This is just like the fat. It's not, it's not necessarily fat. It's like the the fat of the coconut milk because coconut milk is considered a fat. So that's why it looks so white. But the pot is on the fire. The fat is on the fire and um, this is my fish so the oil is supposed to be hot the pot pot supposed to be hot so now oh we're going to prepare the seasoning for it so we have um tomato pepper some garlic and uh, some garlic cloves and some scallion and thyme so the seasoning are cut now so we have our tomato our, all of our seasoning cut now so basically i um add oil to the pot and some garlic cloves and now uh, you have to wait till the pot is really hot especially if you're frying fish because you don't want the fish to break so the pot is quite hot now this is the garlic we got it in the pot, so now we're just going to add it one of our feet. One of our feet. And another one. So now, um, I just set on the pot. It's, it's, it's fine. So now we're going to wash our rice. 
so the pot is boiling we're gonna add our rice now Hey guys, so I will be making the gravy now for the fish. So let me just throw. Turn down the foam and medium heat. I'm going to add some ketchup. And then we're going to add some water. So guys, this is the rice and peas. Very chilly and nice. We're just going to make this steam a little more. And then we lock it off. Fish are in the pot. The fish are in the pot. Now I'm going to cover this and let it smell. Now um, I'm looking after the calories, so I'm going to add the calories to the pot. to cut up the season to add to the kalu. I add a little piece of I add the seasoning now I'm adding like powder season. Not really a lot just a little to give it a flavor to give it flavor. Thank you. 